Thank you for joining this quick getting started video. In this video, we are going to go over how to set up the Salesforce Inbox mobile app for the first time. Please keep in mind that in order to follow these steps, you need to have your Salesforce organization and a Salesforce Inbox license with the corresponding permission set assigned to your user. If you do not have these set up, please contact your system administrator to assist with this. So you've heard so much about the Salesforce Inbox app and would like to get it working for you. If you haven't already, let's start off by downloading the app from the App Store by searching Salesforce Inbox. From here, go ahead and click Install and download the app. Once you've downloaded the app, go ahead and start the app and click on the Salesforce button to log into your Salesforce organization. From here, go ahead and type in your credentials as you would to get into your Salesforce organization. After the screen, you're asked to allow the app access into Salesforce, which you will click allow for. The next page brings you to a wizard to help you set up an email account with your mobile app. Go ahead and click the email service that you will be using. Your choices are either a Gmail account, an Exchange account, or an Office 365 account. For my example, I'll choose an Office 365 account. After this, you'll get to go through the self-guided tour that explains the interface a bit more and to help you get orientated. At this point, you should also start getting some emails in your inbox as soon as syncing starts. Now, if you want or ever need to add any more email accounts, you can do so by clicking the more in the bottom right hand corner, click settings and connected accounts, from which you can click the upper right hand corner plus sign, and once again, similar to earlier, you can click on whichever email service you have. Now that you have your email set up, one thing I'd like to bring your attention to is this list of email accounts page shown here. This page will allow you to see you the connection status of your accounts. It is best to come here to check when you think you might be facing any email or calendar sync issues. Right now, you'll see mine shows connected but sometimes you might see some accounts needing attention or having other statuses for which we'll be creating another video for. Thank you.